Hi Taurus, this is Jackie Tomlin and this is your weekly reading for the week of December 26, 2016. Happy New Year everyone. This is your last week of the year. I also want to remind that you're under Mercury retrograde right now, so not really the ideal time to start new projects, but a time of closing out old business. Uh, also, if you'll visit the channel's homepage, look for the playlist. Each sign has an individual for 2017. They are already up, so check those out as well. Uh, if you're trying to reach me for a psychic reading, please contact me on my website at www.ms-swami.com. So Taurus, this is for your last week of the year, the week of December 26, 2016. Taurus, we began with the Knight of Swords, followed by the Six of Swords, the Ace of Pentacles, Major Arcana of the High Priestess, Major Arcana of the Hangman, and Major Arcana of the Death Card. So a lot of energy swirling around Taurus. I'll break this down and pull three more for you. I want to start off by saying that um, you are surrounded by many people during the holidays, and it does look like that things are going well. But it's also a time that I need you guys to kind of get out of your head. You're really overthinking things. So let's move forward with this reading. Knight of Swords shows that there is something coming, rushing in. Okay, with the Six of Swords shows that you're leaving problems behind. And then there we have the new beginning in the financial sector. So things going really well. But um, I guess one thing I want to really stress with the energy that I'm seeing, it's in a rush, 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 rush. So slow down just a little bit, guys. Okay, uh, the energy, like I said, we are under Mercury retrograde, guys. Okay, and the Mercury retrograde, you can expect kind of the unexpected. Uh, this could be. Mechanical problems, problems with paperwork, uh, computer problems, things of that nature. So there is a lot of energy swirling around Taurus this week. Uh, the first thing I'm seeing is that high priestess. This is where I said that y'all guys are need to stop overthinking things because beside that we have the hangman. Okay, and this could be where you can kind of feel down and out or you feel that you're not moving forward and almost Taurus, almost, I'm not going to say you're completely stuck, but you're in a time frame where you're not moving forward and you're not moving backwards, but you're, there's not a lot of movement around you, but what you need to know, what you need to know out of this is it's okay because the death card represents the end of a negative situation, the beginning of something good, and this is new beginnings ahead. Now, moving forward, we have the Knight of Cups, another major arcana of the Hierophant, and a major arcana of the Lover's Card. Let me give you one more, guys. We have the Queen of Pentacles, okay? Balance is slowly being restored into your life. For those of you that are in a committed relationship or a, just as a couple in general, I want to be mindful that communication could be a little bumpy right now. But if you're single, the communication is wide open for new opportunities. Also being indicated with what we had for the balance being restored in the new beginnings and money. So overall, Taurus, you have a lot, a lot going on here. Okay. We've got the new beginnings. We have the hangman and the feeling of being stuck, a little bit of the delay, communications in the love life. And like I said, the communications there, wide open. And everything, of course comes rushing in. So pretty amazing week for Taurus. Thank you for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe, and Happy New Year, guys. Bye.